We wear the mask that grins and lies. It hides our cheeks and shades our eyes. This debt we pay to human guile. With torn and bleeding hearts we smile and mouth with myriad subtleties. Why should the world be overwise and counting all our tears and sighs? Nay, let them only see us while we wear the mask. We smile, but O oh, great Christ, our cries to thee from tortured souls arise. We sing, but O oh, the clay is vile beneath our feet and long the mile. But let the world dream otherwise. We wear the mask. This poem was written by Paul Lawrence Dunbar. And every year I would have my students memorize this poem, analyze it, create masks, and they would recite this poem. I feel that it is so relevant. It's so relevant with all that's going on, you know, in our world with systemic racism, discrimination, oppression, you know, even with the virus that we are dealing with. The mask is, is so symbolic. It's so symbolic. Those who know, you know what to do. Amen. But I wanted to share this poem with you. It's very powerful. We wear the mask that grins and lies. And it's time to tell the truth. And so I pray that our Heavenly Father will show us the truth and lead us into all truth by the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of Truth. And Christ Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life, and the light. Amen. Always ask for the truth. And so this, this is the day God is going to recharge us with the truth. And you will know the truth. And it will set you free. Where the spirit of the sovereign Lord God is. There's liberty. There's truth. Amen. And so there are different things you're going through. You just need the truth. You need for God to give you a revelation. And I speak that over all of us. God has shown us the truth. And we will be set free. In all the situations we're going through, God is showing us the truth. And once we learn the truth, amen, we're going to soar. And we're not going to wear masks. We're not going to pretend. We're not going to walk in deception. We're going to be free. And I'm speaking symbolically. Symbolically. And as an African-American, African-Jamaican, black person, <laughs> we know how to wear the mask that grins and lies. The one that hides our cheeks and shades our eyes. And it's a debt that's being paid. It's human wickedness when you have to smile even though you're going through systemic racism. And so I ask God for justice for all of us. Amen. And sometimes being a, a believer of the Lord Jesus Christ, we are taught to cover up and to wear a mask. But I will not be that person. <laughs> I'm not religious. I'm going to tell the truth. And I'm going to be authentic. And I'm going to enjoy my relationship with the Most High God. And it will not be on pretense. It's going to be authentic. It's going to be real. I'm going to keep it real. Amen. And so remove your mask today. The symbolic mask. Please hear me carefully. I'm not talking about the COVID-19 mask. <laughs> it's, bigger than the, it's bigger than that. Amen. We're going to tell the truth. How are you feeling today? Today I'm feeling sad, but the joy of the Lord is still my strength. How are you feeling today? Today I'm feeling lonely. I need somebody to talk to, but I know that God is with me and he will provide. We have to be real. Tell the truth. God wants us to be honest and to be free. Be blessed, victorious ones, and I'll talk to you later.